All right, I'm here with Otis, the new boy, new puppy. He's about two years old. I was wrong in the other video. He's about two. He sure acts like it. He's a giant puppy. I have the trailing rope on him because he likes to jump up on me. And uh, I get punched in the face a few times with this dude. He's just huge. Way too skinny. He might be about 150 right now. But he's way too skinny. Oh, Tucker, quiet. Quiet, Tucker. He doesn't care. He's pretty He's pretty relaxed. He's just a happy-go-lucky puppy, really. So, I'm going to try to get some manners into this boy. Otis and uh, see how he does. I think he'll do great. He's just pretty responsive so far. He's just happy, happy to be around, I guess. He can't get much better than that. He needs some coat work and a lot of, a lot of weight gaining. But I'll get him there, that's for sure. Oh, it is. Hey, this way. Good boy. He's just super handsome. <laughs> Smelling all the poops. The trailing rope, he starts to jump on me. I can actually step on it and work him that way. Uh, part of the training. I'm still tired from uh, when they got dropped off. But, but it's cool. Yeah, he doesn't want to deal with too much BS with the other dogs. And that's awesome. Because I have some handfuls here. Especially in the new ones. They're not always the friendliest. But we'll let's get them everyone there. Not all personality types can mingle, just like a human. But I'll figure that out in a safe manner. And I, I do break fingers during this sort of thing because these dogs are just way stronger than anything domesticated. Otis, he's a Armenian gamper, or an Armenian gamper, an ancient breed dog, or that they call a land race dog. And the Armenian gamper is probably the one that most cultures have used. The Caucasian came from the Armenian gamper, just not this big. Um, some of the bear dogs came from these guys. Pound for pound, they're probably the most capable in that sense. And easy to bond with a human, which is not always common for these dogs. So they're very versatile, highly intelligent, um, insanely strong and uh, they do have attitudes compared to others which is perfect he doesn't seem to have much at least not yet but he'll grow into it and that's what you need when you're protecting the livestock from the predators wolves, bears, coyotes packs of dogs things like that you need a dog with an attitude to protect them. So, and I've had some here that that just kind of don't want to do it anymore. And then uh, I put them in positions where they don't have to. So if you have a happy dog in the right situation, 
you have a, a true asset to your farm and just a wonderful companion. Yeah, I'm just gonna walk around Otis. He doesn't really care about the cars coming down the road. He just wants to check the place out. Oh, there we go. Okay. Nothing major from him, so that's good. And he doesn't pull that hard, which is awesome, because he, he can just drag me down the road here if he really wanted to. Want him to go in there. Some bad attitude dogs. Nope. No. No. Good boy. That's how I do it, and it works. Nope. Good boy. He doesn't like his new power. He really wants to check that out. Hi, Otis. And he's been nothing but sweet to me. Nope. Nope. Good boy, come on. Yeah, he hates the new collar. But it's necessary. We'll get used to it. Then eventually the dogs that work here full time, I just take the collars off at that point. So yeah, I'd just be kind of more following Otis around, correcting any unwanted behaviors. Yep, just a big puppy. At about 150 pounds, maybe. So, yeah, just a little bit of a puppy. See, he's just a happy dog. That's pretty good confidence. He's new still. A lot of scary stuff. And he's doing really good. That's a good thing about being young and stupid, right? You just don't know. Don't know any better. And that's good for me, because I could just mold him into what he needs to be. And if you're ever interested in any of these dogs, and this is Otis, feel free to reach out. And uh, I'll see if you can make a good life for these dogs. So, well, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And watch the next videos. Thank you.